According to the popular saying, they say if a house divides against itself, it cannot stand. So when you look at this uh, picture or uh, uh, video right now, you see that Tinubu is getting almost 8 million votes. And uh, you know that uh, Atiko Obaka is so a split of PDP. Atiko Obaka is getting more than 6 million votes. And PDP is getting uh, more than 4 million votes. And Kwanpaso uh, is getting more than uh, 1 million votes. Just combine uh, the vote that Atiko got, P2B and Kwanpaso. You see that APC will be beating black and blue. I mean, PDP will be talking with, let's say, 6 million votes. But they couldn't agree with each other. Atiku cannot be coming up every year under the platform of PDP to contest for presidential election. He should have given another person, you know, a chance. But he didn't do that. And not just that. P2B had so many meetings, you know, so many discussions with Kwankwaso. Kwankwaso said he cannot be vice you know, to Peter B because he claims well, he's an engineer, he's a doctor, he has PhD degree, so he cannot be uh, a, a vice to Peter B that has a master's degree. But he, he just forgot in a hurry. He quickly forgot that a professor of law, Yemi Oshibanjo, he's a professor of law, he agreed to become vice president to Buhari, who we don't even know how his work, that failed work, Buhari failed work. But Yemi Oshibanjo decided to be um, Buhari's vice. So, Kwan Kwaso, he is aware that he's never going to win the election. So, he's just trying to be in the race. And that is greed. That is so bad and horrible. He just won Kano as many people projected. He has not been able to win any other states. Even though he's not in you know, a Western state, he's not winning any. So, Kwan Kwaso's. Uh, uh, behavior is, is, is despicable and many people are condemning him for that. So you don't want to be vice to anyone because you claim to have PhD. And that's all you have got. And many people have come out to call him president of Kano and made a lot, you know, they made a lot of jokes about his decision not to be Peter vice. When he knew or he knows that no, it's the turn you. of the no, south. I mean, let's just say southeast. No southeast person have ever ruled Nigeria for, for let's say, th more than 30 years now. And Buhari just finished his eight years, and that's the turn of the north. So it's time to move to the south. And Kwan Kwaso is not interested in hearing that summer. He just wants to be in the race. Let's see how long he's going to be in the race to win presidential election. Because with all, with all indication, P2B, who everybody believes well, uh, that is in a structuralist party, in a party of religion, uh, is winning in Nasrawa, is winning in Plateau State, is winning in, almost winning in Benue State, is winning in FCT. So this guy has a name in Nigerian political space. But for Kwan Kwaso, he's a doctor, uh, engineer of water. That's what we know him for now. No, not the 10 million. Not the 7 million is both there now. They say you are, they say you are always the vote. Now I see the vote you are not always now. Come on. People were crying new Nigeria, new Nigeria. And then you still carried Nigeria and gave it to all other people. All candidates for all things.